This is Jessica Parks with the Peninsula Press, and I'm going to take you on a quick tour of the Quake Catcher network. I followed the instructions online to install the software and activate the accelerometer inside my MacBook. So now I can open up QCN Live, and I get this nice rotating globe. I can click on the globe and drag it to see a specific location. The pink lines represent major faults, and the dots represent seismic shaking. If I click on one of the dots, all the data for that quake will pop up on the bottom left. It's important to point out that not all of these little dots are actual earthquakes. The sensors are really sensitive, so they can pick up shockwaves from a truck driving by your house or a door slamming. So the network isn't triggered until five or more computers in the same region log the same type of shaking. This graph shows the shaking under my specific location. It's a really helpful teaching tool because if you bang on the table or jostle the receiver, you can see the magnitude right on your screen. This is another graph of my specific location, just a different visualization. You can set any of these graphs as your screensaver, and there's a lot more tools to poke around with, so if you want to give it a try, you can go to qcn.stanford.edu.